and this is 26,500 square kilometers. It has 500 kilometers of beachfront. Two thirds of this is sandy beaches, islands, coral reefs. One third of it is mountainous terrain, drop, very steep drops, and all of it is untouched, beautiful. You have mountains that go up to 2,500 meters. You have a climate that's really nice, really nice, the wind blows all the time, you know? So I saw it and I thought, where on earth, you know, can this, can this happen? And then you look at the geography and you say, I mean, 70% of all people all around the world can be here in this place in no more than eight hours flight time, you know? So the, if you look at the transit routes, 10 plus percent of all transit go through the Suez Canal, you know, you have the telecom routes going through there. You put all these things together and you say, wow. And then you start and saying, well, what have we got here? I mean, the kingdom has been blessed with oil and gas. We know this. The kingdom has been blessed with the new oil and gas, which is sun, right? And Neom has been blessed on top of it with wind, you know, so we can create something that is fully regenerative powered. Zero carbon, carbon, net zero carbon, you know. We actually think that we can export from there, and I'm sure Masa-san is going to talk more about it because he's going to help put this vision into reality now, you know. So this is, this is very exciting. And then when you pair it with the idea of, I mean, if you think about, there's a shift. I mean, I, as you know, Maria, I mean, I've got uh, two daughters, you know, uh, 23 and 28, you know, and when I listen to them and their friends, you know, there's a different generation. There's a different, there's a different view of how the future should look like. Sustainability plays a big role. Quality of life plays a big role. And they all want to be part of the technological revolution that's going on. So our great vision here is to bring these things together, to create a place where we can live very well, very, very well, well in a way that's more back to where humanity came from. But you pair it with using technology to help do this and accelerating it into a future that makes the human more, uh, makes economic benefits, has economic benefits, but puts the human in front, you know? So that's, I mean, that's inspiring to me, and um, as His Royal Highness said, I'm very much <laughs> inclined to put my fingerprints on it, and he's helping every day on it, and every night. 